Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. So once again I'm doing sort of generic intros and outros. I will be going back to Into the Field this next week. Um, I'm not editing as late as normal, but it's just going to be quicker and easier to do the generic intros. So hopefully you all enjoy the videos. There's a lot that happens and at one point we have like a huge archaeological discussion, but mostly it's a, this game stuff. So <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you're having a good week and I will be with you in a second. So many grenades! Grenaten! And some guns, cool. It's a good thing I don't have an inventory management aspect to this game. It's a good thing you don't need money. Power battle armor, cool. Alright. So that was the armory. And there's these rooms. Oh, I think the people that we fought heard us in these rooms and came out. And the droids and everything, so they're probably empty, I say, as I <laughs> smash this door open. Ay 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 ay! Why are you why are you even have low health? Why, why are you such low health? Ah, uh, that's a computer. I don't need it. It's fine. We're good. I don't need a computer. Go 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 go! All right, there's a room over here on this side of the hallway that I want to check out, and then we'll go to the catacombs. See, usually, I didn't turn off the thing where it's like supposed to pause when you enter into combat. So it keeps not pausing, so I keep being unaware that there's enemies. You just life stole. Stop doing that! Stop it! Stasis field. Take that. What? That is the Come on. We got things to do. I'm glitching out again. We're having a hard time in this temple. Can I please? Nope. Okay, whatever. I don't care. I'm not gonna use the majority of these things that I get anyway. Back to the catacombs. Get out of my way. Get out of my way! Oh my gosh. The the freaking box interaction, like the model interaction is ridiculous. At this point, I'm not even looking at the game in front of me. I'm just looking at the mini map like a cheater <laughs> Ooh, I should turn my phone off or turn it down anyway okay also in my haste today I forgot to eat lunch so I'm gonna grab a snack super quick before we jump into this but I'll be right back here we can walk I guess Okay. It doesn't say it's in the... Oh, there could be information stored in the temple. Hmm, hopefully it's in the catacombs.
Why are Bluetooth headphones so expensive? That's what I want to know. I had to buy some today for work. And if you want to get a decent pair, like, you have to get expensive ones. Also, hoses. Why are hoses expensive? Are we gonna, are we gonna attack or what here? <laughs> Get one from an office closure? That's a, that's a good idea. Your wish? That's what I did actually. My one of my dad's offices were closing like for like the place he worked for at the time. And I got this desk from that. 47 credits, thanks. Or, uh, like, warehouse things. Like, I know my university will have, um, like, like, the, the university will sell their, like, extra stuff. Like, we got, like, a projector, and they have, like, kitchen, like, tables, and they had, like, a whole, like, stove set. They had all kinds of weird things. So, your univer- I don't know how it works over there, but your university might have, like, a warehouse where they, like, sell all their, like, stuff for super cheap. I know. <laughs> I want a plank of wood to stuff in the corner. I know. It's rough. Oh, dang. This looks like... Uh, do, I, do I not want to step on this? Oh. Y yes. Oh, it's like a lock thing. Okay. Um... Wee, 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 wee. Oh. Okay. I thought it was gonna be, like, one of those, like, because, like, when I, whoop. Yeah, I know. When I walked on this one, only this one turned blue, and I was like, oh, haha, but it turns out it's like this. Okay, hold on. Um... Out of sight, out of mind. Yes? Oh. I know. Th this puzzle is always in freaking. Your wish? It's always in Bioware games. Oh, is this like. Is that like the reset button, maybe? I know, I know, they do. They, they, I, and I, I should know, I should know the solution by now, but I don't remember. Did you? Did, why did you guys move? No, I'm actually not sure how to. Oh, solo mode. Excellent. Okay. I remember this distinctly in the Jaws of a Con DLC. Pretty sure you can't step on the middle one. Uh, that you need. <laughs> you did. You did mean the caps. Don't lie. Oh come on. Hmm? Your wish? Okay, 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 reset, reset, reset the puzzle. No, please stop doing this! I get, I understand. Um... Okay, this one changes those ones. Can I undo it? Yeah, undo it again. Okay, and then this this one this one only changes that. Okay, this changes those ones. Oh dang it! Oh okay. god! Oh go! Okay, there we go. Oh no, I messed up. 
I'm oh jeez. Okay, hang on. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Okay. There we go. There we go. A little bit. A little bit. Not sort of. I mean, I got the middle one, which is good. Um. Okay. Okay. I almost freaking have it. I almost have it. Alas. Reset. Reset. Right? At least in the Hakon version, there were multiple solutions. Uh. Uh. Okay. Um. I think... No, dang it. Um. Oh, shoot. You gotta, like... Wait, 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 wait. I think, I think I remember. Reset, reset, reset. Maybe I remember. On the... Maybe I don't. Oh, I don't. Nope. I can get all the. This was. No! Dang it! I hit the reset button! That. I, I, the way I was doing it was the way to get the. Everything except the outside. The, in, the interior one. I know, right? Nah, Disco Doormat. Disco Doormat will open the- it be a perfect key. Perfect. Alright, I'm not gonna work. Oh, I've messed it up. I've messed everything up! Okay. I, I remember doing this for hours, not hours, forever in the Jaws of a Con. I was like, I was determined to figure it out on my own. Hang on. Mm -hmm. No! You have no recollection of this? In like in this game or in Jaws of a Con? Was it like No <gasps> Oh yes 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 ah, I'm a genius 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 uh, hello, computer. You didn't play Jaws of the Con? That surprises me. You would enjoy it, Rain. I mean, it's got a ton of lore in it. I'm not revving anymore. Bring car. Rondi haudonga ku honga bi. Wala kumbes. Cheng pala moli tong king ba no kongke. In my composition. Thank you, thank you, Stonesmith. <laughs> These changes have been noted and recorded in the database. Cool beans, thanks. Uh, your database. Kachicho ita hotonga. It's just the NSA, it's fine. There have been a few, there have been few events worth recording. Thank you, 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 Wala kumbes, cheng pala moli tong king ba no kongkik. Tukning tachokun, ne molera best. 
Je me dois la nibobo. Don na bon chanon gang. Don patoga smak telia. Why is it so dark? Je no bolie dark. I require you to turn the lights on. Tell me about the Star Forge. Tak on just tak Mickey Grabber Mogo. Kachicho ita how down. Don patoga bon chanon gang. Factory in a battle dreadnought. Can produce immense fleets with a minimum of time and resources. Shares the same construction used in my own technical construct, whatever. It's like a living entity. It feeds, it hungers, it draws on the energy flowing through all living things. That what you call the force? What? The Star Forge feeds on the force? Wow. Okay, I actually wasn't really expecting that. The ability to feed and consume the living energy of the force is the key to the Star Forge's power, but ultimately led to destruction. What do you mean? The Rakata are by nature cruel and savage species. No, they're not. That's nobody's born cruel and savage as a species. Accentuated those traits with the builders. Star Forge is a tool of the dark side. It corrupts those who uses it so that it can generate greater and greater amounts of negative energy. Well, what if we made it nice? Well, they were strong enough to control the effect, but they were wrong and became the victims of their own creation and eventually their nature and turned them against each other. Civil war destroyed the infinite empire, a lesson to remember. Only one who was immensely strong in mind can harness the power of the Star Forge without suffering a similar fate. Oh, is that why I became corrupted? Because Malik and I came out here and we were good people. That's right, we were good when we came out here, I, I think. I think we were, by the time we got to this point, we were still like Jedi. And we probably off we offered to help both of those groups or whatever in order to get through, and but when we got through, we became corrupted. So we didn't help the elders, but we also didn't care to help the other group either. So our mind wasn't strong enough, and we were corrupted by the Star Forge. Mm, can I set up the disruptor for you? Well. Uh... How can I get to the upper levels of the temple? You unsealed the but they weren't sealed this time. Oh. Just that, the subtle neurological changes? Yay, they're open. Ask me something else. Uh, do you know about the star maps? They were built on Concord Worlds as a symbol of Rakatan dominance and glory. It showed the whole expanse of the infinite empire of the Starboard Center. When the empire fell, the Rakata fled back to their homeworld. They sabotaged the star maps so the enslaved species could not use them to discover the star world of this planet. I used the star maps to find this place. They were created with the same technology and violent self-sufficient systems. Over the millennia, the maps have been slowly rebuilding and repairing themselves. Star maps are still in damage in complete state. It's not possible to locate the star board without using this. Yeah, right, right, right. So this explains why we had to use different pieces. Mm -hmm. Uh... Tell me more about the history. Sure. Well, the Rafa Fighter Planet was comprised of 10 billion Rakata and over a trillion slaves scattered across the galaxy. But in the glory of the Infinite Empire was built, uh, but the glory was built on war and slaughter. It was inevitable it should collapse upon itself. That's very self aware for this AI. Conflict among power hungry warlords escalated into a civil war. Worlds were ravaged and millions of lives lost. Sensing the weakness of their oppressors, the slaves rebelled and overthrew their masters and they came to plague. The plague. Hey, a plague! How very topical. Perhaps the creation of an enslaved species, perhaps the mutation of a natural virus that killed only Rakata and it spread to every corner of the galaxy. Infant Empire crumbled into dust as the few Rakata survivors fled back here to their homeworld. All evidence of their existence was destroyed by the species they once enslaved. Even hidden here on their secret homeworld, they are not safe. Millions died from the deadly plague. Many more died in the never-ending civil war. The history of the Rakata ended 20,000 years ago. Now they are nothing but a few scattered tribes descended from the priest and warrior case, still waging a never-ending civil war. Well, we ended that war. Oh, Destro, hi, you found me speed reading. Welcome, Destro. Thank you so much for the raid. We're playing some coder. And I'm speed reading because the aliens take too long to talk. I hope you had a good stream. Welcome, welcome, everybody. I want to add you something else. Woo, yay! 
raid. Girl. It's a raid. As always, thank you so much, Destro. It was very kind. Uh, I should I should get a raid command. That's I've seen some people have those. I should do that. How's the game going? Pretty good. We're close to the end, I think. How can I shut off the disruptor field around this planet? I'm in like the very final zone. Disruptor field is constructed as a Star Forge's primary defense against the enemy attack and can only be deactivated from the upper levels. Okay. I okay. I already did that now. I do something else. Okay, bye! We eat in a Danya Yita. What a young Hi, Critisol, how's it going? Welcome, welcome everybody. Oh we do! <gasps> we have a raid command? Oh my gosh. Did somebody make that? Yes, are you an archaeologist too? Me too! <laughs> Hi! Where do you work at, if you don't mind me asking? I work out in like the western US, like the Great Basin, like occasionally southwest area. Colorado Plateau type stuff, type stuff. But yeah, I don't know if that's like a, I don't know if that command is like a, an auto command or what? Maybe it's an auto, like, one that's, like, built into, um, like, built into the Nightbot somehow. Yeah, I think it's built in. Yeah, it must be built in. Okay, so we got what we needed from, yes. The elder researchers would find this useful. I'm sure they would. It didn't really have any genetic... Oh, he da that's right. He downloaded it to my computer. To my tablet. Okay, so I need to go to the upper floors now. And... Well... What else? What all is in here? We go! Ah! I didn't even realize there was a rune covered pillar here. I'm just. Wh why are these all exploding on? Why? Archaeology is so hard here, you reverted to security currently, dude. No, I feel. I feel you. I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Wow, that's. Uh, I'm, I'd be super interested to hear. Like, is it like COVID restrictions or just archaeology in general that's like. Like, not. Like, I, I've been reading, like, a lot of, like, um. Or like I guess several like European um, like uh, works I guess and like talking about like the, the differences between um, like uh, archaeology done in the UK and archaeology done in um, the US and it is different in its own way in slightly different ways um, was that door did that door down there go somewhere but, um, like, I, I think what I was reading is that it can be difficult to do archaeology in general out in the UK. Like, just, like, getting, like, the projects and getting approval for the projects out there. Um, lately. But I don't, and then I, then I wasn't sure if, like, COVID restrictions were, were causing problems. We just, we're going out, but, um, we're trying to implement like various safety procedures like wearing masks whenever we can but you can't wear masks all the time because it's freaking hot out and you're you're surveying everywhere right i'm just i am super jealous of the buried treasures i mean europe in europe in general you freaking like you guys have so many things out there that like so many ruins that we don't have like we have we have a like a long history out here obviously with like the native american tribes but like we don't have like ruins like you guys do over in europe for an archaeobot you're an archaeobotanist oh my gosh i don't specialize in anything i only have a bachelor's degree um but i've been trying to do like i've been trying to like teach myself botany just for like a hobby essentially but, like, to, like, you know, help with, work, like, archaeobotany and, like, there's, like, the archaeogeology and all that. There's all kinds of stuff. There's all kinds of specializations, which is what kind of drew me to 
archaeology in the first place. Where's... I think we need to go back over here. Yeah. Was that, like, um... It's so multidisciplinary. Like, I, I love the multidisciplinary aspect of archaeology. But recently, I've been trying to study soil science because we don't excavate much over here. We just, uh, we do lots of surveys. But we'll do test pits every now and like, like just like, you know, like a, like a meter, like, circle, like, meter in diameter, um, like, half a meter in diameter, really, test pits. Um, and then we'll have to, like, you know, tell, we're like, oh, yes, there's the soils, blah, blah, blah. But I'm like, I don't know what any of this means about soils. Like, what? Or like, I, I know a little bit, but like, what does like the coloration mean and like the texture means? I've been reading up on soil science lately, but... But botany is something I really want to learn more of, and I really want to volunteer at the local, like, botanical center, but... Can't do that right now. Also, I can't move. And we're gonna call it there in maybe, like, a funny or a silly or an awkward place, but once again, generic outro, so who knows? <laughs> but hopefully you all are enjoying the videos. I appreciate you watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.